this is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world, both established artists and non-established artists. And today we are going over to Brazil and we're checking out Gabriel Enrique. Now, this particular song, I have reacted to this particular song by a number of artists and one particular artist um, um, sat out really, really by far because he played by acoustic guitar um, and that is Eng, um, Thomas Eng. Please check that out. Now, this is Loving You, right? This song, the artist in itself, Minnie, uh, Minnie Rip Ripperton, she has got some kind of... Um, I don't, uh, an amazing ability of hitting some serious high, high notes. In the game, she also knows how to split her vocals. Yeah, I don't know what it's called. She can split her vocals into two and harmonise with it. So have two vocals singing out at the same time. I don't know how she does it, but she's seen, she's done, there's a handful of artists that can actually do that. I don't know what it's called, but they can actually split their vocals in half and harmonise. Like, like two vocals coming out of their mouth. Like what? How? What? But yeah, uh, I believe if you go onto YouTube and 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 you know type in split vocals or whatever have you, you understand what I'm talking about. I just don't know what it's called. So look, loving you. Um, it speaks so much volumes. This song, it really, really does. And I, I, I it Mini has a, a a I don't know a a strong bond within my family from my my nana and from my mum and you know, from my auntie it's got a strong hold in the family this song and one of the things that i remember about this song is that nobody like everybody sings a song until they get to that high note and it's like nobody could actually hit that note and if you was to be able to hit that note you was one of those divas and they'll put you on tv straight away it's one of those things so to know that we know that Gabriel Enrique can actually hit those notes. It's also, what else is he going to add to this? What else is he going to do to make this song, which is a absolutely iconic, classic song, how is he going to make it his song? Because I don't want just an artist to sing this song word for word, texture to texture, melody for melody. I don't want that. I want to know somebody that can master 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 this song to a point that now I can adapt and make these song make a couple of arrangements and changes and make this song mine. You know, claim this song for yourself. And that's what it is about doing cover, song covers. It's not only about yeah. There's one stage of you like mastering the song and singing that song word for word. And, you know, lyrical. You know, you know, melody, melody, melody by melody and structure by structure. But you've got those other artists that want to do much more than that. This is this one. So, without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video audio music. Can you dig it? <laughs> He has to, I know he will. <laughs> 
was the amazing Gabrielle Enrique uh, mini Ripperton song uh, song cover Loving You where do you start with amazing artists like this I've said it so many times and I can carry on saying it over and over at times um, this guy is a walking living legend his skill is out of this world from top range to bottom range. I know he doesn't show a lot of his bottom range, but when he does, I'm sure you will appreciate it. It is absolutely phenomenal. It really is. The structure, I hope he learns more English as, you know, years and years go by because he's going to be forcefully transcending over to many, many countries as, as long as he carries on singing. People will want to know who he is. And he's just had, he's just come off from the one of the biggest platforms to ever present yourself in a performance wise. So already people want to know who he is. They can't wait for his songs. And that's why I believe he should be doing original songs, original contents right now. If he goes back to doing cover songs from after having a massive platform such as uh, Americans Got Talent, then something is sincerely wrong. There really is. He has now mastered every kind of cover songs that needs to be mastered. There seriously is. There's no next step. The next step is and always should be his own original contents and what he has. It is so amazing to and, you know, amazing to hear what he does on cover songs. We do appreciate these things. We really, really do. Because he executes them in, in a way that we all would wish and dream that we personally could do. But he's an artist. He has his own right and own lane to follow, his own destiny to follow. These cover songs that should be and are platforms for, to get him to a wider um, audience. And like I said, he's just come back from a seriously large audience. So doing a cover song from that, that is not the right schematics to have. You have the audience now, you have the love, not only from your countries, but from many other countries now. No matter what language you sing in, you know, the world is watching you. We'll see what you got, man. Till next time. I salute you. Boom. Wicked song. Um,